welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Boxing New. Southpaw Boxing exposed, and look, let's break it down honestly and objectively as possible, and Southpaw Boxing has come out with a response to me. He was too afraid to say my name, but he stated two reasons why he believes Anui is a hype job. He's standing on this stupidity. He truly believes Anui is a hype job, and these are the two reasons. The first reason is Anui got rocked by Donaire. He states that's why Anui is a hype job, but that makes zero sense because one of the guys that he fanboys for is Demetrius Andre. He didn't just get rocked. This guy got dropped by Vinus Monterosian. By that same definition, Definition. Isn't he a hype job? Not only did he get dropped by Minus Monterosian, he got dropped by another journeyman in his last fight. So this guy's been dropped multiple times by multiple journeymen, but he's not a hype job, but Anui is? And mind you, Demetrius Andre's never been undisputed. Not only that, his favorite fighter of all time, David Benavides, this guy was dropped by a journeyman. Is he a hype job? Because once again, by your own definition, if you get rocked, these guys got dropped. That must make them hype jobs, right? Not only that, the second reason that Southpaw said Anui's a hype job is because this guy has never fought an undefeated black American world champion. That's why he's a hype job. That's his second reason. Well, with that same logic, the face of boxing to Southpaw is Gervonta Tank Davis, and this guy has never fought an undefeated black American world champion. Not one. So how is Tank Davis the face of boxing? Shouldn't he be listed and called as a hype job? By your own standards, you're calling Tank Davis a hype job. By your own standards, you're also calling David Benavides and Demetrius Andre hype jobs because neither one of these guys has fought an undefeated black american world champion you gotta keep that same energy because men lie women lie but the facts don't lie